In this video, we're gonna be taking a look at configuring OnSong to work with a hands-free wireless pedal system called the AirTurn BT-105. With the AirTurn BT-105, you can control a lot of functions in OnSong hands-free. This is a very handy thing if you are using OnSong and you play an instrument and need to keep both hands on your instrument without having to be distracted by touching the iPad screen to advance the song or change songs in a song list. So again, with the AirTurn BT-105, you can control a lot of functions without the need to touch your iPad. You just keep your hands on your instrument and you focus on your music or your presentation. Let's start from the beginning by taking a look at your AirTurn. And in this example, I'm using the AirTurn BT-105 with two ATFS2 silent pedals. In any case, whatever your configuration, whatever your two pedal configuration is, let's go to the transmitter, the AirTurn BT-105 transmitter, press the red power button and hold it until you start to see the power indicator flash on the LED light. If it's at full power, it'll start flashing green. Let's go back to your iPad now, and let's tap the settings icon. And then let's go into the Bluetooth settings, which you'll find about the third panel down from the top. You see airplane mode, Wi-Fi, and then Bluetooth. Let's just tap on that. And if it's set to off, I want you to tap on the off toggle to turn Bluetooth on. And in a moment, it's going to search for all active Bluetooth devices that are within range. With your BT-105, your AirTurn BT-105 turned on, you should see it appear under the list of devices. If you don't see the AirTurn with a serial number right after that being listed, you may see it as simply noted as a keyboard. Either way, the AirTurn BT-105 actually is an external keyboard. So whether you see keyboard or AirTurn BT-105 or AirTurn with a serial number, I want you to go ahead and tap on that panel. It says not paired right now. And it's gonna take anywhere from 10 to 30 seconds to complete the initial pairing. The first pairing is gonna be the longest, but after the initial pairing, it'll be basically instantaneous. You'll be able to turn your iPad on, turn your uh, AirTurn BT-105 on, and the two will find each other really within just a few seconds. So the first pairing is the longest, and then you really won't have to worry about it. Okay, I'm gonna click on my home button over here and let's go into OnSong itself. And initially you'll see a register uh, invitation. I highly encourage that you fill this out because it'll enable you to receive enhanced support from the OnSong team. So when you get a chance, be sure to fill this out and have that submitted. Okay, so do, do register with the OnSong team to enhance your support capability. All right, so let's go into OnSong settings. To do so, you'll see this toolbar on the top. What I want you to do is I want you to tap on the icon to the far right. It looks like two gears. So the top, top toolbar, far right icon, tap on that, and then you're gonna see a tools window appear along with some other options uh, popping up in this window. Tap on settings. This, it's kind of the second from the bottom here. Tap on settings over here. And then you're going to see, actually what you're initially going to see is this. Uh, I changed the settings to you can do the screencast. So you're going to see that this is actually a two panel or two column window. With your finger, you can actually scroll the left hand column and scroll down until you see something called foot pedal control about the fourth from the bottom of it. Tap on that. Okay, and on the right-hand side, you're going to see several options. Tap on the top option that says Pedal Setup. Tap on that panel, and then again, it'll kind of shift to the right, and you're going to see an option for Pedal Type. Right now, it says by default, iOS compatible. Tap on that, and I want you to go in the next window, tap on Air Turn, and have that selected as the Pedal Type. Okay, and basically, we're done. You can go ahead and click on, tap on Done. And with the pedal, if you're looking at your pedal from the top, when you press the right pedal, it'll scroll your words forwards. And if you press the left pedal, it'll scroll your words backwards. All right? And now when you get to the bottom, I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of scroll ahead a little bit with my finger, but when you get to the bottom or the end of the song, if you have your song set up in a set list, like I have kind of, I've done this ahead of time, but when you're at the end of your song and then you press forward one more time, 
it'll advance to the next song automatically in your set list. And then you can continue going forwards and backwards with both pedals. And so that's a quick look at setting up the Airturn BT-105 with OnSong.